football fans right here with the interview Nigeria football fans after matches and we'll give you Nigeria football fan content back to back so if you're new I bet click that subscribe button and thank you so much for watching 3-2 <laughs> win and um, most important thing when they come back from a loss now to win your next game and um, your, your thoughts on the match bro welcome back first of all welcome back yeah <laughs> but, but, but generally on the game I feel um, we should have done better we should have played better but the major thing, like you said, is that we got the three points, you know. Especially when you reason the fact that we lost to City and then, you know, traveling far to Cyprus. So getting the three points was just the major thing. So the fact that we got the three points, no matter how eh, no matter how dirty it came, they were just carrying on going and move. We wait for everything. Interesting. And then thoughts on uh, Martial coming off the bench uh, in score again today? Uh, Martial, my thoughts of over Martial. Uh, well, I'm not really particularly impressed with what he did because I feel he's not really that sharp. Although he scored today, he scored against Man City too, but um, he's he, he's not that as sharp as you know. Fitness never really. Never really there. But still, it's good to say we get options like Marshall, Rashford, people with your speed come off the bench with options. So good one for Marshall, and it's also good for his form and for his um, psyche and mentality and everything because I mean, the last game he scored two. This game again he came out and scored. So good one for Marshall. Um, Virgin from Portugal, peace for that post. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I swear, they did everything to, to make Ronaldo score, but you know, just work. Some days they went no beyond, they no beyond. They nothing where you know do today, nothing where you know do today. You get one way now, you get one say way in one. I don't even just understand, but we move, we move, we move. I don't know what thing happened today, but I feel Ronaldo, he has, he has this. Um, he's not just looking for him at the moment. So anytime in near post, there's this block. Can I do it? Can I do it? Can I do it? But I believe one thing get that one, two, three to so just keep coming. Yeah. And then um, this team, surely, surely, this is United's basically starting lineup. So it's good enough to give a clean sheet now, at least against these people. Now. See, that, that defense now, Lindelof. Lindelof. Lindelof is good. I like him for his passes and everything. But you see that composure, that strength and concentration in defense, Lindelof is not there yet there. Uh, so most of the game, most of the goals today, I won't fault it to Lindelof directly, but he still has one or two. He's not that. You know, he gave everything around the give, that's extra, that's ginger. Lindon of now, semi semi now, kind of defending. You get, you need someone that will, actually if you're partnering someone like Lissandro Martinez that is small, you need someone that will compliment him with that height, and that's what Varane gives. The combative, yeah. that will be strong. But Lindon of now, all this JJ kind of, and then that's what we consider today. And then the goals also, goals also that um, Omonia has scored, very good goals, so no fault. But the fact that we won, we move from here. We move from here. And then, your thoughts on the group? Surely, surely, soft work now, Abby. Uh, it, it should have been softer than this because, trust me, we see Omonia do we never expected it, but we should qualify tops because I believe our next game will be Omonia at Ultra Ford. We should win. Then we should play CC It's just between we and Sociedad who will top. But I believe that we should because we're waiting Sociedad do us for our home. We will go back there, do them back. You guess. You guess. So I, I believe this group is still ours to win. It's still ours to win. And Everton. Everton coming now. At least um, a win now boosts the confidence small, but yes. going to good this impact now, from far high they look that much. Uh, ever since they are on this very small form, they, they don't this small form, they beat to in last match. So. Best defense in the Premier League so far at the moment. So, and then they get, he will be our boy and everything is here, so I'm expecting to be a very, very tough match. Because trust me, any team, even Man City, if they go good this thing, even if Everton are not really good now, but they still does not Everton be this, you get, and that home, that good impact, they did very, very hard, and then come with the fact that now, we did a period now, some kind of small, small plots. Varan now is out, this one is out, we don't know who start. So um, I believe we should get the win, no matter how scrappy it is. That's why I'm sure um, Ten Hag took off um, Bruno, Antonio, and uh, who should that person again early on? I think um, Casimero. Cas Casimero came, on, uh, came off later came on, Came off later on, but the legs of Bruno and Antonio, just because we need our fresh legs for. Anton, um, Sancho was even hooked off almost at the uh, beginning of uh, halftime. So I'm sure Eric Ten Hag already has that game on his mind. Uh, I believe we should win. It will be a very difficult game, but I believe we should win. Yeah. Nice one, man.